Thanks a lot, guys. This is DJ E Devious, and I'm up here on Route 1 in Saugus at the Kowloon for the 2008 Halloween Rock Fest. Now, I'm going to catch up with the man. There's a lot of great bands on the bill, but we're here in particular for Ernie and the Automatics. Put your hands together for a rare treat. Ernie and the Automatics! And some of the money coming in tonight is going to his foundation, Music Drives Us. So let's walk around, grab some egg rolls, and see what everybody's doing. Well, we're here basically to open up for the legendary Rick Derringer. It's uh, a combination of Music Drives Us and the Kowloon Concert Series. So a portion of the profits for this show go to my foundation, Music Drives Us, which is dedicated to bringing music to the public and private sector. I'm on the board, uh, Music Drives Us, and uh, it's just a really, really great endeavor. I mean, Ernie's is so generous to give out, first of all, two million of his own money, and now we're raising money, we're selling, we sell t-shirts, CD, 100% of the money goes to Music Drives Us. So it really, it really is a great endeavor. There's not a whole lot of support out there, a lot of times, for music and the arts, and uh, Music Drives Us has been absolutely killer in helping out uh, you know, low-income areas, uh, come up with money for music lessons. Make some noise for Ernie and the Automatics, come on guys. getting together we have such a great time every time we get together it's the way a band should be it's just great how does it compare to playing with Boston well you know the, the whole Boston thing it took off so quickly there was a lot of pressure you know a lot of pressure to perform with this we just have a good time go up and play and you know it's carefree it's great Has Ernie hit you up to buy a car yet? No new cars yet, no, no, no. So you play in his band, you make him look good, and he doesn't even hook you up with a ride? I did get a watch, though. We haven't had the original drummer on the first three records, which means it just took him a little longer to get fired. There's the Simi Hashin on the drum. Boston was on the big skate stage and you know we were a big scale and playing for 20, 30, 80, 100,000 people at a time. But believe it or not, it's I think personally for me it's more fun playing with this band because we get to play off each other more and you know playing clubs is a lot to be said for it because you can hear each other. There's a seriousness and earnest about doing what it is you do. And the professionalism that is there is extraordinary. And a great bunch of guys. Getting an opportunity to play with Sibby and Barry um, and Timmy. And, and this combination of guys is real exciting because I've known everybody and played 
with them for a lot of years, but never in this combination. It's, uh, it really gels. We love being together, and we make uh, really good music together, I think. And the new record that's coming out, we're all excited about it. What's the date for the new record? February 17th. February 17th, iTunes or just uh, in the stores? Um, no one Ernie, it's probably going to be everywhere. Nationwide release, earning the automatics, low expectations. Well, now I've been thinking back on all the stories. How it was back in the day. You try to rewrite all the glory. Not let the truth get in the way. We were traveling all down the high road. I just spent two hours upstairs rocking. I am all rocked out. It was an unbelievable time with world class musicians. Ernie Bach Jr., the Ernie Act himself. MusicDrivesUs.org is the foundation if you want to get involved. The only thing driving me right now is a stiff drink and a plate of Chinese food from here at the Kowloon. Reporting from Kowloon on Route 1 in Saugus, this is DJ E. Devious. Back to you guys.